Hi, I'm Connor McClendon. Last week, the transcript traveled to Springfield, where I interviewed meteorologist Jacob Wyckoff about working for Western Mass News. Uh, my name is Jacob Wyckoff. I'm a meteorologist at Western Mass News. I started here uh, back in June of 2015, and I became full-time in November 2015. So I've seen the station grow, and uh, I love doing the weather. And now they're kind of expanding my role. You just saw me host the 12:30 show, doing some step dancing on St. Patrick's Day. So. Yeah. So I'm curious, this is uh, kind of a small building, but you have ABC, CBS, and Fox yeah. all working in the same building. What is that work environment like? Well, it's a beautiful work environment. We've merged two different stations uh, back in 2015, April. Uh, Meredith Corporation purchased ABC and Fox, and they moved CBS, which used to be downtown, up to here to the, our Liberty Street studio. And it's been a very flawless transition. Uh, we are seen on Fox, CBS, ABC, as you mentioned, and really there's no um, issues whatsoever. We can use video from our CBS uh, corporate um, side of things, CBS News and ABC News. Um, it's just two different, we're, we're seen on all of those stations, so it's, it's very seamless though. Uh, you wouldn't know, oh, they're only on ABC or they're only on CBS, we're seen on all of them. And finally, I'm just kind of curious, as a local news station, how do you balance covering national and local news? What we like to do is we try to national, we t try to take those national stories and bring them to a local level. So recently, there have been threats uh, for Jewish centers uh, across the country, even here in West Springfield, there had been some. So we try to bring those national stories that are garnering attention, whether it's uh, police brutality, and bring them back home. Uh, immigration, obviously a hot-button issue, and we try, try to find someone or something that can help tell the story here in our backyards. Because uh, ultimately you can see stories that are happening at a national level, level, but unless you're connecting to it locally, oh, that's happening to my neighbor, or that's happening to this city down the street, sometimes you don't have that appreciation for what's happening. So we, we do try to take those stories and, and make it hit home a little bit more. I agree. Thanks for talking to us. Of and course. For